for I a think long this time. Asbestos. Did anybody touch this? No. No. We're gonna pull all this down. But I don't. You know what? I don't even want to touch this until that we actually, find out if that's asbestos coating. I think it is. So do I. We're gonna have to call in our asbestos team. That's all out. We don't, we don't want to touch this. this. No. It's a war zone. Is this the walkout structure? Yeah. So we're in the dirty room. We go through the shower. Once you're through the shower, you're in the clean area. Cool. Yeah. This is not a small job. This is the job. biggest part of this job, the setup. The removal is only going to take us about an hour, so they'll be done. Wow, you guys don't mess around. Basically. When I came in here and we took everything down, believe me, this place was a mess. We pulled two yeah. bins out of the basement alone. And the first thing I saw was this, and I knew it was asbestos. That's why I called you in. Is type three the worst? Type three is the worst. Basically, you got to show what we're doing right now. Is this is type three. Because there's over so many square feet, right? After so many square feet, you got to settle for type three. OK, so now that we're at a type three, obviously, this is too much. Must be totally wrapped. Right. Now you're yep. going to put in the air unit, which I see right the here, negative air, yep. the negative air, yep. right? And what that's going to do is pull out all contaminants, throw it outside, it, yep. and then keep the inside clean. Yep. As Everybody you take it safe. down, you'll bag it, yep. make it airtight, right? Yep. That way it can go out. We soak it down with asbestos when we do a type three. OK. We soak it down. With so, water? Yeah, with water, yeah. Water, dilute water. What that does is help uh, keep, keep it, everything from flowing through the yeah. air. Okay, that makes yeah. total sense. Yeah. And the idea is to tent this right off that we work our way upstairs into the shower unit, yeah. which you clean yourself off and yeah. get rid of all contaminants. Yeah. All right, so not recommended for your average homeowner. No. As long as you don't touch asbestos, it's not a danger. But as soon as you play with it, move it, break it, it now releases fibers into the air that are extremely dangerous for you to breathe. What these guys are doing is using a mixture of water and glue. And the idea is to knock down the fibers onto the floor, the fibers, the particles. We don't want it floating through the air. So this grabs it, holds it, easier to clean up. Marky, hey, we got a sample. We're ready to test this out. Got a sample. I'm gonna set it up. Look through. Look at this, it through the microscope. This is absolutely regular. Each and every time you have a crew come in to do a test, we'll have an outside crew, someone totally independent, to test to make sure it's safe. Yeah, testing the air quality within the the site. Make sure it's matches what you guys are breathing out here, and then it would be safe for everyone to go inside. It used to be 360 liters to clear uh, of air. I'd have to collect to analyze. As of November 1st, it's become 2,400 liters. So that's seven, eight times the difference, isn't it? Yeah. The other new thing is forced air. So I take a leaf floor, blow and all the surfaces. purposely move it. Yeah, move all. If there's any fibers that are loose, it becomes airborne. Because of the size of the type three enclosure, I had to take three samples, all of which have to pass. We'll find uh, hair fibers, skin sometimes. It sucks up with that, whatever's in the air. I've just taken a quarter of this. So if something happens while I'm mounting it, I've got another three quarters to work with. Very good. I can't see through the filter, so I've got to uh, blast it with vaporized acetone. The filter will go clear. Oh, look Once at again. that. I'll count every fiber that I see in 100 fields. I've got to, I've got to look at 100 different fields and count the fibers in there. And not necessarily are the asbestos, but we are on the side of caution. So now I'm just looking for fibers. I move the, uh, the slide itself around. And I think you're good. What have you marked? I've got two fibers, two fibers and 2,400 liters. Can I see through this? Sure. Just to take a look, just out of curiosity. Oh, that is wild. 